your merit. And that would be based on the verbiage used in your educational skill levels, right? Does that make sense? Yeah, the skill level. My skill level is... Well, it's higher um, than you're getting credit for, is what I was hearing. Say that again? Your skill, your it's higher than it's the uh, more than versus less. Yeah, than. it's more than because I'm not a recent graduate. I've been doing this since 2009, and so to put me in a recent graduate level is insulting. Right. So they didn't. That's based on merit. Mer, mer, look up the word meritocracy. I need to myself. Anybody else out there? If I use words, I need to go look them up. <laughs> I have to figure out. I'm trying to talk in the simplest of way, and I get it on higher levels, but I'm trying to bring my thoughts down to a lower level so I can speak normally and understand what I am trying to communicate because we're all working together immortally at the same time. We use all our past lives and our future lives in the now. We'll be here now, and ladies, uh, hang in there. Keep being positive and just join me when you can uh, in spirituality. I appreciate you joining me and being. Please like my show on the physical reality under Blog Talk. It's TJ Morris ET Radio, and uh, I'll come back and meet with you, ladies, and uh, we'll work towards whatever it is that's going to be better. But uh, remember, everybody, hang in there till May fifteenth, and uh, at least in America, all three of you, ladies. That's strange. That aren't you all around New York? That's my mom's birthday. That's so funny. Who said that? Me and Katie. That's your mother's birthday. Yeah. Cool. Isn't that funny? Yeah, yeah, that's great. And I'm actually, I'm actually wearing a shirt with the number fifteen on it. <laughs> <laughs> Synchronicity, isn't that amazing, Katie? Well, see, Katie, I yeah. love the magic and I love the puzzle of Anna and Anna, my my normal Anna nine one seven. I can see you ladies' phone numbers, but I'll know your energy, and you all three can work together there. Uh, I wish you knew each other, but I guess you could maybe come back here and get to know each other until you feel comfortable in three D form. But uh, maybe you ladies will help me with. Uh, our extraterrestrial work, being uh, immortals. Keep doing your goddess thing and uh, come back. See if I'm on tomorrow, but normally Katie and Anna, uh, mm-hmm. I, I don't show up doing this kind of work very often unless I'm called to do so. But uh, I'll do my best to hang in with you ladies and uh, stick around a few more years. I'm only 68 <laughs> in this reality. Oh, you have long go, yeah. You have long to go. Not getting away that easy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I love you, ladies. Mm-hmm. And thank you for being so intelligent with the universe that you tuned in. That's absolutely amazing. And we did have three. That is so wonderful. Katie, Anna, and Anna. Two Annas and Katie, all from the New York, the great state of New York. Uh, and the 541, 917, and 914 area codes. But, uh, I guess what we'll have to do is just figure out what all we're supposed to be doing together and uh, come back in. But, Katie, uh, I hope you and Paul do okay and come back and let us know how that works out. And Anna with the little gremlin. (laughs) So, but what can I do about this whole thing at work? See that working out for me? Well, you always do well, Anna, uh, but I, like I said, I, I think it has to do with uh, meritocracy, so look that up and look up your merits and look at what's written versus what you really have, and uh, that should, as long as uh, you watch your tone whenever you speak to them now, watch your, your how, let's see, how do you say that? Learn about speech and intonation and the, the various levels like a singer, but when you speak to them, because you're very forward, but you have this young, very uh, feminine voice, like Katie and Anna, all three of y'all have a very similar voice, and you're all very uh, sweet, 
and uh, giving and caring and uh, represent the female goddess so typical of Athena, right? So as a as a person, Anna, you know it's going to work out. It just depends on what it opens the door to the next level of your existence. So take a moment uh, in this process and make sure that everything – I keep getting told to tell you to write it properly. So, you know, take it for what it's worth, my higher self or my past life or my angel or my guide or my soul self or my mortal Thank soul. Thank you. Because uh, I can only tell you what I, what, you know, it's like a compelling to tell you if it comes. If it doesn't, then, you know, it doesn't. But a very compelling to make sure of whatever it is that's written, make sure it, uh, you get merits for the word, just like I told you in OPM. And okay. That you're, you're based on the way the word and words. You are in your field of work, and you're you're very good at, working with younger people you're still working with children uh adults now no longer working with children well that's interesting yeah I know. Uh, well you're still working with art yes still working but with not art so much anymore either not so much anymore either I, everything changed wow all right, well, I'll just have to wait and see with the next chapter of your reality because uh, I'm just getting that it needs to be written. And I didn't understand the uh, – I couldn't understand what you were saying, so I'm only going on uh, feeling emotions versus uh, whatever your description was. They didn't let me hear that. It may be like Katie said that I I checked out. or I, You know how sometimes I didn't hear it. In other words, you were speaking, but I couldn't hear it. I know that doesn't make sense. It happens sometimes. Well, ladies, I've got to come back, but uh, you'll be fine, Anna. Just make sure it's written properly. And with Paul, hang in there because uh, you're going to, with the way the world is right now, everybody just sort of take a breather for about seven days, seven to ten days. Hang in there. Of course, everybody knows, the, you know, if you're out trying to stay home, try to, not get out in public, and if you do, be sure and wash your hands if you're in a group of seven or ten or more. But just, you know, be careful touching things and breathing things and all that. Yeah. But we all got our, we've got our, uh, most of the women that are in the cosmic chatter area, we're, uh, what do they call it, fortified with the uh, vitamins, and we make sure we have enough vitamins. So, ladies, take your vitamins and make sure you have enough yeah. D for uh your units of uh, D and K, but you know, we're all pretty smart women. We know how to keep our, what is that system that keeps, it's a human thing, a carbon. What is that system we operate under? Immune system. And that's it. Immune system. <laughs> Make sure that you're healthy, wealthy, and wise ladies. <laughs> and, uh, Come back, stay high energy, and make people laugh a lot. Laughing is a good deal. And this is just a, a place we're at right now. We'll be helping each other. And I'll do my best to come back and tune in. So, uh, Anna, we're under spirituality. Is that not where we're supposed to be? Isn't that where uh, we show up and do readings? Yeah. Or is it sometimes paranormal? Or is it always spirituality? Anybody else know? Y'all found me. Well, just look, and everybody like me, please, and I will uh, do my best to support you, ladies, and we'll work together to change the universe because life is change, and we're all here on a learning planet to learn. So I will come back and uh, hopefully not wait a, four or five years to do a cosmic chatter. We'll come back, and I'll, I'll bring my tarot cards. Uh, what, Anna, when did I used to do channeling, I mean, uh, not channeling, reading tarot cards? I like doing those. Those are fun. Do you remember? Yeah. That, what night was that? Do you remember? No, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Okay. Well, folks, I guess it doesn't matter, but I'll pull my tarot cards out. Maybe I'll do uh, do those, but I'll try to come back yeah, on the sun. Yeah, I don't know you did them, what day you did them, but you did them. Okay. Well, love and light, everybody. Stay happy. Stay plugged oh, in. Nice to talk to you again. 
God bless Bye. you. Bye. So nice having you, ladies. Thank, Thank you for being a part of my life and a part of our show. You can come back and listen, and uh, we'll do some more. Uh, tune in to uh, Cosmic Chatter. Yeah, thank with you very Marcus. much. It's so nice to hear from you again. You too. It's nice to be human and to have time to do something in this reality. Folks, as long as you're here, you can still do something in reality. You still have your body. Remember, it's hard when you don't have your physical body. So uh, use it to your best advantage and you know, get everything out of your way that you need to on this reality level and help us in the ascension age because you know, in some other places, we just have each other as thoughts. <laughs> oh, man. It, we really do have some <laughs> beings that they're just etheric. <laughs> Love and light. We'll talk about anything here. Keep the faith, folks. Okay, and I'll what is you your next it. show? Hopefully tomorrow. I'm going to try to do Sunday a spiritual show. Well, and, we're here for you. We're here for you. You know that. Well, Anna, thank you. Thank yeah. you, Anna, Katie. Y'all come back and be regulars and... uh We'll just do the best we can to help each other. That's all we can do, folks, is hang in there and know you're not alone. And uh, we're all advocates for the Cosmic Oracle. This is your Cosmic Oracle and uh, Cosmos Commander signing out. Love and light, everybody. I shall return, I hope. Love and light. Bye. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Bye Bye-bye. Thank you.